What's up, KP Nation? It's your girl, The Real Crochet. You already know what I'm about to do. If you've seen the title of the video, I'm finna do another Dollhouse University reaction. What's up, KP Nation? It's your girl, The Real Crochet, and I'm back with another video. Okay, so basically um, the season is over. So now the the reunion has premiered. I'm gonna put a little clip of how good I look at the reunion. Put a picture in the sun. Hold on, right there. Bet, cause I know you saw, if you came this far, then you saw how good I look at the reunion. Yeah, yeah, that's flat. But anyways, so I'm basically here to just talk about the reunion and what happened in the reunion and how I feel about the reunion and all that, all that, all that, all that. So I'm going to start with, um, I don't like how the reunion started. I don't like that it just started with us walking in. I feel like it should have started with like a real introduction, a recap of the season or something, you know, but that's just me, you know, I'm just saying, I just, I didn't like that, but Every, outside of that, all the girls look good. Kiana look good. Kat look good. You know, everybody look good or whatever. Um, The reunion kind of just started with us coming in. You know, they seen me sitting next to Amber, you know, big bitch. You know, drinking her alcohol or whatever because that's what I was doing. And I look good doing it, period. Anyways, okay. So, <clears throat> I walk in our city and they want to talk about the fact that I had the same braids. Actually, I did not have the same braids. I had different braids. And y'all, when I say they, I be referring to the comments because I read the comments of every episode because I be honestly intrigued to know how y'all feel about it. Because I be trying to see how y'all feel about it because, baby, I'm going to know how I feel about it because I'm in it. So I be trying to see. So I want y'all to tell me something. And I be happy that y'all be coming because y'all comments low-key really be like, y'all comments be commenting because we be reading them. Believe me, baby, we be reading them. My friend T, she didn't explain to Bob 13 times. Y'all done came for this girl hair so many times that she didn't had to get on Instagram and tell us. We don't want to know what happened to your hair. They want to know. So, y'all go follow her, Pretty Girl T, so y'all can find out why she had that. I was trying to be stiff like her Bob. Why she had that Bob, okay? Even though she, the girl, you know, my girl said she had some technical difficulties before coming into the house. All that matter for real is that she made it into the house. Y'all, y'all, you know, y'all worry about the wrong thing. I ain't not saying y'all worry about the wrong thing, but y'all worry about the wrong thing. So, after all that, whatever, the reunion getting to it, basically, Kiana wants to, well, I feel she told Olivia to come sit next to her. I'm going to be honest. I love me some Kiana, but Kiana, Kiana know what she be doing. She know what she be doing. Baby, Kiana know how to stir the pot. She knew what she was doing. She wanted to stir the pot, and she did. Because they felt the way I think Kiki was like, she needs to come sit down here with the rest of us. I honestly didn't give a fuck what a girl said. Like, that's the thing. And I be telling them, the more and more y'all react to anything that happens with Olivia, the more y'all seem pressed. I don't give a fuck what a bitch sit. She can go sit in a dumpster for all I care. And that's just that on it. So, basically, after, you know, uh, you know, Kiana told Olivia to come sit up there. Um, I don't remember. Somehow, Nita ended up sitting up there, too. I don't really remember. Y'all, the reason I said I don't remember because they cut out. Like, they really didn't cut too much off the reunion. But I was over the reunion being at the reunion. Like, the whole time I was there, I was ready to leave because I felt like the girls was doing too much. They was yelling over each other. You couldn't hear everybody talk. So, most of the reunion, to me, was just back and forth. Back and forth, yelling, 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 yelling. Now, me and Nita had our moment where we talked about our issues or whatever. And Ka Let's talk about Miss Dean Cat. Kat decided she wants to be petty and gonna ask me, well, do she stink for real? Because you keep saying she stink. And I wanna know, you know, we wanna know because you eat just a minute ago, you say she stink. Blah, 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 blah. Y'all, I really feel like she was trying to be petty right there. I hope I ain't got no crust in there. That's good. I really feel like she was trying to be petty for real. You know, I definitely feel like Kat was trying to be petty. However, you know, I feel like she was trying to be petty, hell, child. That's my part. You know, that's my opinion. But, I like Kat. I just feel like she pity, you know? So, me personally, 
Again, like I said, and I say this a thousand times, Nita does not stink, you guys. I said, only reason I ever referred to her having a smell was I was referring to the fact that, like, the burnt hair smell. I never was saying, like, well, I don't know. Did I can't I can't tell you exactly what I said, what I didn't say. So I probably did say that she stank, you know, in the middle of an argument or said some shit. I know I said something about her smelling like Newport's or Black and Miles. But even then, some people like the smell of gasoline. Some people like the smell of cigarettes. How do you know that just because I said she smelled like that mean that I'm saying she stank? Exactly. I'm just wondering. But anyway, go. She don't smell like that. She smell like flowers and daisies and you know peaches and cream like every uh everybody the fuck else. Now, speaking of stank, there's a part of the reunion, if you've seen the reunion, where um, somebody, I don't remember who referenced it, somebody referenced Olivia stanking, and then I was like, well, the girl said that she smelled like a seafood market. Okay, and I really hate that they kept that in there because I felt bad hearing me say that because that's kind of messed up. I'm a woman too. I'm a woman first, always. But if I'm being honest, I didn't actually smell it, okay? Because I had my own room and I had a connecting bathroom with Monet and Larnay and they smell good, I smell good. Nobody else really used our bathroom, honestly, besides Ashley or Holly. Honestly, because I really didn't let people in my room. And then uh, Nita and them would use Monet and Larnay's like bathroom area, but I don't think they ever really used our toilet, but they probably did a couple times, be the way it go. Nobody that used my area stank. So all I know is somebody, I remember at the house, somebody came and told me that people were saying that it stank behind Olivia. I had never used that restroom. I had never went, well, I only used that restroom at one time, one time I told you I was taking a shit, but that's, I don't know how I ended up on that toilet. I think somebody was using it, I was, I don't know. But, and even then, Olivia hadn't just come out, so I never smelt her. So I was literally saying, this is what they said she smelled like. But then in the middle of that, you wanna argue with me, you wanna argue. You want to, I don't want to do all that. So then it just kept going back. I was like, I see food market. I see food market. Y'all, and I feel bad because I'm not even that type of person. Like, I'm not the type of person, you know, like, I don't care for that. Like, I don't care for arguing. And it's like, that's the hard part for me. I don't care for arguing because I really be ready to, and really like, and I don't fight like that. But I'm just saying, like, I don't care for arguing for that reason because me, once I get mad, that's that. Like, I'm going to be ready to fight. So... Honestly, it was really just a lot of arguing back and forth. Um, the good part of the reunion ain't even to next week. Um, so Sunday, they're going to be dropping the good part of the reunion, which is the rest. I'm not going to tell you, but it's the rest. So I can't wait to see it. Talk about that one. I'm actually trying to give y'all that reaction sooner. Um, honestly, and then after that reaction, I'm going to talk about a little bit like what's in store for me next, what I'm going to do next. Um, outside of building my YouTube and all my platforms, my TikTok, my, uh, I'm the real crochet on every platform, TikTok, Facebook, um, Instagram, I'm not the real crochet, but if you type in the real crochet, it will pop up because it's on my, it's on my like headline, but it's not my actual app. So it is what it is. TikTok, uh, Twitter, I'm not the real crochet. Either. It's really my first last, my first name and my last initial. So if you know how to spell my first name, which the real crochet. If you know how to spell crochet, then you know how to spell crochet, which is my first name. And then you put the P behind it, boom, you'll find me, you know? So make sure y'all, you know, y'all stay up to date with all my platforms because I do have a lot in store. I have a lot of big collabs coming up. I have a lot of things that I'm going to do in the future. I may or may not be auditioning for another show. So stay up to date. Um, honestly, this reunion, I really can't say too much about because it really wasn't too much having happening t and holly argued a little bit but honestly they argument keeps giving me I, i'm not gonna lie i really feel like t don't want beef with holly and i feel like holly just picking that t at this point like just leave her alone that's how i feel you was okay when you tell anybody leave you alone or tell She's anybody talking. you know all that yeah, so that just doesn't make sense to me you done crochet yeah I'm, I'm done basically what she was saying i feel like that too at the end of the day, bro, I was fucking... Like, just leave her alone. She don't want smoke with you, little ba. She don't want smoke with you, little baby. Just leave it alone. That's how I feel. Um. So, yeah. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'm out.